What's up, fellow gamers? It's Zero coming at you with another um, news update. Uh, uh, I'm going to keep these general discussions going so we still have videos coming out uh, as I'm doing all the templates and everything. Well, anyway, uh, apparently everyone's in an uproar over this uh, EA uh, access and, and, and Sony refusing it, okay? And I could care less, okay? If, if, if sports games is all you do on a PlayStation, then I guess, yeah, that, that might perturb you a little bit. PS Now is coming out anyway. Trust me. PlayStation guys, you're going to have plenty of old titles. You're going to have plenty of EA titles in your PlayStation Now. So there's no reason to pay, pay for uh, PlayStation Now and EA Access, okay? And PlayStation Plus is basically what they're saying. Is There's no reason to pay for it, okay? Most of the games that are going to come out in the EA Access 2 are sports games. You've got... Um, uh, uh, Dragon Age and everything, but they're gonna come out five days early, and who gives a shit? You know, um, five days early is not really, you know. I mean, if it was coming out a month early, then I'd say, yeah, okay, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have to get the service, okay. But since it's just five days, and it's probably just the demo anyway, we're not losing anything. They do the same thing with Call of Duty, Call of Duty, and 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 Battlefield, and them. You know, they come out. A month early on the Xbox. You know, it's just the way that it is, okay? And I don't think it's a month. I'm, I'm not sure exactly how long it is. But, you know, I mean, they come out early on the Xbox all the time. So, you know, it's something PlayStation owners have gotten used to. So it shouldn't really be a big deal. You know, it's it's the sports players, it's the casual gamer it's the that, that are affected by this. Because it's it really doesn't affect me. You know, everyone's like, well, but Dragon Age is coming out, and all these EA games are coming out, and da, da, da. I was like, yeah, but they're the demos. They're not going to give you the full game for five bucks, ever. They will never do that, okay? So for all you guys that are jumping on the bandwagon and saying this is a great practice, this is worse than um, um, uh, uh, GameStop's practices. Okay, this EA access is worse than GameStop's practices. But what EA's doing is they're trying to get you into the digital Okay, digital downloads, digital this, digital that. But I'm sorry, dude, if I don't have a physical copy, then I don't own it. And, uh, again, just going back to, uh, uh, the access, you're not missing out on anything, PlayStation guys. So, you know, stop flipping out about it. You're not missing out on anything, okay? You're not gonna get the full game for five bucks, okay? You're not gonna get to play the full game before it's released. It's just not gonna happen. You're still going to have to pay the 60 bucks. So basically what PlayStation was saying is, why would we have our fans, why would we have our players pay $30 a year, which is an extra $5, okay, an extra $5 a month, on top of the $60 they're going to pay on the actual game. And with EA saying that all our games are going to have microtransactions, it makes me wary to get any subscriptions whatsoever, knowing that every game is going to have microtransactions, knowing that every game is going to have... I mean, there's just... They're just piling on stuff that they want to, you know... When all they have to do, if they want more people to buy the game, is lower the price a little bit. 10 bucks, 15 bucks, you know, start making games 45 and more people will buy it. But, um... You know, that's my take on it. Um, it really doesn't affect me. If it affects you guys, let me know in the comments section below. And, uh, yeah, let's have a conversation. Uh, let's talk about this. If you disagree with me, if you agree with me, whatever, uh, rate, subscribe, and uh, let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys uh, on the, the uh, next uh, Kickshaw Brothers discussion.